most people, ladies and gentlemen, they get comfortable. They stop growing, they stop working on themselves, they stop stretching, they stop pushing themselves, and they end up becoming very cynical about life, and they throw in the towel on themselves, and on their families, and on their dreams. And the other thing is that most people don't feel worthy. What I'm doing now, I could have been doing years ago, but because I did not have a college education, because I didn't believe in myself, because I allowed other people's opinion of me to control my destiny, I didn't act on my ideas. It's necessary that you associate with winners, that you work your system, that you are relentless, that you never give up. It's you, you've got to take personal responsibility. You've got to make it your personal business to make it happen. And you've got to resolve within yourself that I can do this, that it's hard. But you've got to say, I'm the one. I'm the one to make this happen. I'm the one to become successful in this business. As you work to help other people to become successful, that feeds your success. But you know it's going to be hard, but find out what will make it worth it for you. Following your dreams is a lonely, solitary, scary, dangerous pursuit. You can't wait for somebody to think you can do it. And it's like, they, they, because they don't think you can do nothing they can't do. It's like, it, it, it's a lonely, scary, dangerous pursuit. And you got to be willing to risk everything to become that seed of what you believe you be is in there. You got to be fearless. You got to be relentless. And, and, and as much as you, you, you want to be able to listen a little bit, because somebody's going to give you a gem, but you, nobody knows but you. You can't get advice on what you should do with your life right nobody knows what you are like even even sometimes you don't really even know what you what you are you got to take your shot and it, it's like as much as you want people to agree and you want the people around you to be supporting your dreams and all it's not going to be like that all the time you got to do it alone and people will help you and when you when you get the ball rolling people will jump on but if you don't believe nobody else is going to believe if you stay in your comfort zone that's where you will fail you will fail in your comfort zone success is not a comfortable procedure it is a very uncomfortable thing to attempt so you got to get comfortable being uncomfortable if you ever want to be successful i love to tell you look you can go out here and get rich do a couple of things, dang, dang, yeah. You gotta get real darkish. You gotta get downright funky if you wanna make it. Now, like I was telling you before, if you wanna be ordinary, you ain't even gotta listen to me. Just go on about your business. But if you are sitting in this room and you have extraordinary aspirations, then you're gonna have to do extra. Rich people don't sleep eight hours a day. That's a third of your life. It ain't but 24 hours in a day. You cannot be sleep eight hours a day. You can't live in LA and wake up at eight o'clock in the morning. It's 11 o'clock on the East Coast. The stock market been open two hours. They already making decisions about your life and your ass will sleep. When people laugh at your visions and ideas, it's only because they don't have their own visions and ideas around what they're supposed to do with their life or their careers. You have to be relentless. You have to never let off the gas, never stop, never quit. Never allow anyone to talk you out of the dream, the vision, and ideas that God has sent you.